Great fight in Detroit and tonight. Mayor Mike Duggan is fighting back about his decision to move Bill Pulte out last year. Senate investigator Jim Kirchner broke that story earlier this week on that breakup and tonight he shows us why the mayor says he has demolished 100 to 200 structures a week himself. You know, I, I like Bill Pulte a lot. When he was here, he was knocking down one house a week. The mayor added this this morning to a big business crowd. Detroit's doing lousy and we're doing well. And I think, what do you mean? He's referring to Detroit Blight Authority founder Bill Pulte, now in Pontiac with his nonprofit, removing 300 blighted homes and confirming publicly for the first time Mayor Duggan booted him out. I was asked by Duggan to not be in Detroit, and I'm fine with that. The mayor fighting back, saying his program, not Pulte, got national recognition during a conference last October. I was the featured speaker because Detroit is taking down houses at a rate that's never been seen in the country. The reality is that if you're going to be successful with this big of a project, you can't be worried about who's going to take credit. Mayor says $50 million in federal grants were used last year, another $50 million this year. It will run out in August. We are working now to get a new source of funds to extend it beyond August. And uh, I don't know what that is yet, but we're working hard on it. If you don't get it, how, how crushing would that be? Again, we're going to find a solution. What I will tell you is any day of the week that Detroit will welcome us back in, I can raise a lot of money and help out the city. Pulte also says he's starting That's blight good. programs in Chicago and Gary, Indiana. In Detroit, Jim Kurtzner, 7 Action News. All right.